We don't know that the taser was the cause of death. You see, police say the officer used this taser brand unit, model X-26, to stop the victim from approaching him in what was described as a chaotic crowd of people. The officer described him as, as appearing angry, agitated, uh, his fist balled. Uh, the officer ordered him to stop. Police were responding to a 911 call for assault in front of Turner Hall. Police are also investigating and anticipate criminal charges for the initial incident. Assistant Chief Jeff Corcoran says this is the first on-campus death after use of a taser, which are rarely used by officers. We use a taser on average, I would say, five or six times a year. It's a pretty uncommon uh, use for us. It's shocking, actually. You see, senior Frank Alexander says he was on the south side of Turner when everything happened, but did not see or hear anything. For something that dangerous to happen and us not see it, we was out here until 6. The victim was staying at Turner Hall as part of the Upward Bound program, a pre-college session to help students before starting classes. While UC students say they feel safe on campus, they are not convinced a taser is necessary. People have altercations and they might lead to fight, but you don't have to really use a taser. But those who live near the University of Cincinnati's campus say carrying a taser is smart. It's safety for them and us at the same time. I don't feel like there's nothing wrong with carrying tasers. In the vast majority of situations, you know, you get right back up afterward.